Hi guys, welcome to ASA Technical. Most people reinstall Windows when they hit automatic repair low. But here I am going to show you a way out without losing anything. It's frustrating I know, but if the cause is corrupted registry, there's a fix that might be save your system. In this video I'll show you two CMD method that can help you to fix automatic repair low problem. So let's get started. Deep inside Windows, there's a hidden folder called RegBack. It's short for Registry Backup. Inside, you will usually find backup copies of registry hives. This is the brain of your Windows system. So first, we will need to check if those backup exist. First, boot into Windows Recovery Environment. If you are already in Automatic Repair screen, you are halfway there. But if not, you can force it like this. Restart your PC. As soon as Windows start loading, hold the power button to force shut down. Do this for 2 or 3 times and Windows will boot into recovery environment automatically. Once there, click on advanced option. Then command prompt. In command prompt, type the following command to see what inside the RageVac folder. Type dir space c colon backslash windows backslash system32 backslash config backslash regback. Look for files like system software default sam and security. Make sure the file size are not zero bytes. If they are zero, this method won't work. In that case, you will need to try different repair method. Just wait for the method too. If the backups looks good, it's time to restore them. Type copy space c colon backslash windows backslash system32 backslash config backslash regback backslash asterisk space c colon backslash windows backslash system32 backslash config backslash and press enter. It will ask if you want to override the existing files. Type A for all and hit enter. Now type exit and hit enter to close the command prompt. Now restart your PC. If the issue was caused by a corrupted registry, your system should boot up like nothing ever happened. If it still does not boot, don't panic. This just means the problem might be due to corrupted system files, drivers related or the bootloader related. If the rageback does not help, try this from the command prompt window. First, you will need to be sure that which is the correct drive where Windows is actually installed when you are using it from Windows recovery environment because the drive letter can saved in that environment. Here's how to find the correct booter and correct winter. Type disk part and hit enter. Then type list wall and hit enter. It will list all the partition with their drives letter, label and file systems. Look for a volume that has labeled like OS, Windows or something similar. Uses the NTFS file system. Is larger in size, typically your main drive. Now type exit and hit enter. Then check for the actual Windows folder. Type dir your OS drive letter colon backslash windows and press enter. If you see folders like system32, logs, boot, etc., that's your correct Windows directory. Once you found your OS drive later, then type sfc space forward slash scan now space forward slash off booter equals your OS drive later colon backslash space forward slash off winder equals your os drive letter colon backslash windows 
of border points to the root of the drive where windows boots from of window points to the actual windows folder on that drive now press enter don't worry if it seems stuck but it's not frozen this can take time especially if your system has a lot of files so keep patience and let's windows do its job Okay, as you can see, the operation completed successfully. Now close the command prompt and restart your computer. After that, check once, hopefully your problem will be solved. If it still does not boot, this means the problem might be due to drivers related, hardware related or bootloader related. Don't worry, here are some advanced command prompt tricks to force fix the problem if it's driver related or bootloader related. So I hope one of this method was helpful for you. If you have any question then please let us know. Please like, comment and share. We need your support. And guys please don't forget to subscribe our channel. Thank you. Thanks for watching. Have a nice day.